morning everybody welcome back to my channel my name is Talat um I hope everybody's doing good on this Tuesday morning I just wanted to start my day out and uh come talk to you guys I know Saturday I said I was gonna come back with a video and I apologize and if you're new thanks for stopping by clicking that subscribe button and joining the family and if you're returning I appreciate you more than anything um well, really what's been going down, after I did that try on haul on Saturday, I was exhausted. And um, I had to take care of some other things. And uh, more so too, my mother told me she needed me to take the baby again. And I just, at that moment, excuse me guys, I'm crossing the street. So if the camera go down or something, I'm just paying attention to traffic. Um, I had to be honest with my mother and tell her like, Ma, I can't do it. I can't take this baby right now because I'm healing. You know, I'm not gonna ever say I'm broken again. I'm healing and I'm trying to get to a place where I'm stable in my own ways. And to bring a baby into the shelter, I just think it's just <sighs> nothing against people that's in the shelter with their children because I know when you're in a situation, things happen. I mean, it is taking on a new responsibility while I'm already in the shelter messed up myself you know what i'm saying when i messed up but you know trying to make ends meet and uh if you were watching my previous videos i hope you was you would know that i got this this whole case going against me and these guys are trying to sue me from 2009 about an apartment that i was in so i'm thinking to myself maybe this is why i've been getting denied for apartments i just don't know but at 10:30. I got my appointment so that's been on my head i've been really like nervous about that and then i really feel like i'm growing away from chad not in a bad way i just feel like i'm growing so much that you ever feel like you're growing so much in your progress you feel like you're leaving some money behind and my job is not to my job is not to change him, it's to better him the best way that I can without losing myself. And I feel like now I'm starting to lose myself a little bit because I'm trying to concentrate on us just having such a good relationship when I can't be the only one. Y'all look, look guys, I don't got no nails. And this one broke a little too much for my liking so I put a band-aid on it. Uh, I'm in the Bronx. I'm headed to work right now. It's nice outside. It's beautiful out here, actually. And, um, yeah, I'm just blessed. But, um, as far as everything in Chad is going, I don't know what to say. I wanted to do the try on haul with him and everything, but I don't want it to look forced or anything like that. So, I, I had to clean the camera lens real quick. I didn't want it to look forced or anything, but y'all see a girl weight coming in? <laughs> y'all see how fat my face is getting? I feel so good, you know? Um, I'm happy. I couldn't be more happier because I'm achieving things that I want and I wanted I wanted Chad to come along with me, but <laughs> This morning I really felt like I really felt like Maybe he loves me, but he's not in love with me to fight as much as I'm fighting and then I say that's the maturity You know what I'm saying? He's much younger than me and I don't want to push him so so hard that I push him away so I'm just in a standstill right now but uh, it's a different type of standstill well I actually feel pretty pretty good but at the same time I'm hurt you know I don't know what to say <laughs> all I know is I got this case going on I didn't want to leave you guys just kind of like not stranded but not come back with another video but also keep you like, just keep you updated what's going on specifically with the situation, the court. I just told you guys that my mom, she's telling me to take the baby. Not the older one, the younger baby, the five-month-old. She's telling me to take her. She can't do it. And I feel so bad for my mom because she was just thrown into a situation like, here, take care of some kids, you know? And it's just... I got on the hoodie. Ask me why I got on the hoodie right now. Because when I get upstairs into my job, it's so cold that it's, it, it hurts. But on another note, your girl birthday come in. I know I look distraught this morning. I'm coming to work looking a little drier than usual. And that's because I woke up discouraged. Like, 
I'm scared to leave the shelter if Chad and I break up. I'm scared to leave, to start over. Nobody likes starting over and I'm just scared. You know, like I wasted, I, w I would feel like I wasted all those years in the shelter for nothing, just sitting there. But then I say, you weren't wasting anything because you had a place to stay, a roof over your head. You was warm in the winter, good in the summer, and the rain, the snow. So it's not like anything was wasted, you know what I'm saying? But I know God is so good. He's going to show me the way. And he's not going to show you on your time to let his will be done. His will. So with that, guys, I just wanted to come in, do a quick little check-in. You know, I'm going to try my best to come back with the, the, um, he rates my outfits, you know what I'm saying? And if not, I'm going to get one of my friends to rate my outfits. And what else has been going on? Pretty much, um, y'all know how the job has been going. I'm grateful to have a job, so. What the? How is that on my lip? It looks like something's on my lip. But yeah, y'all, y'all see my face? My face looking chunks. <laughs> it feels good. It feels good. When you set out for a goal, you achieve it. It feels so good, you know. I'm about to go in here, start work, make coffee for everybody. I got my court thing going on. You guys pray for me that these guys don't win and they can garnish my check. I don't want that to happen. It's not going to happen. God is good. I've been manifesting. They're not going to take the money from my check from 2009. You're not going to come get me now. Not when I'm trying to win, trying to get an apartment and everything. Because if that judgment goes through, it's going to be on my record. You know what I'm saying? And the first thing people look at when you got an apartment is like, oh, no, you didn't pay your rent or whatever happened. And what happened was I paid my rent for the last month. The last month they charged me again when I wasn't even staying there that last month. And then what happens is the interest over all these years occurred. So when no actuality, all they look supposed to get is a month's rent and then turn it to $3,000, almost $4,000. I'm not. I'm trying to stay positive at the job, you know, because I told you my home girl left, and once she left, the new girl, the one that I had issues with, they gave her the work and started teaching her the stuff, and I'm saying to myself, girl, you still getting paid, what you worried about it for? And it's not about worried about it, it's just like, hey, how come y'all didn't consider me to learn something new? I'm sitting here with nothing to do, and that goes to always, that goes for me to say like, damn, you know, it's my self-worth. Because if I really feel like a man doesn't love me, it doesn't matter. Go. Start your life over. You'll be okay instead of worrying about what the show is going to happen. That's just my fear and just changing, you know. So God is good. He's going to always show me the way to go. And I'm so grateful that I have him. But, um, yeah, guys, I hope everybody has a happy Tuesday. I'll be back tomorrow. Or if not tomorrow, I'll be back later on to let you guys know what happened with the case, you know. I'm not sure if I'm going to get a judgment or what have you, but I know that something gonna happen in a little while a little outfit of the day ain't nothing too crazy got my breakfast right here two hash browns and um yeah thank you guys so much you understand we over 800 we over 800 soon i'll be able to do the lives and um interact with you guys a little bit more but thank you so much for subscribing to this channel thank you so much for for coming along on this journey of ups and downs and just a woman trying to find her way with a man and just living life um needs the budgetista i appreciate you going through all the videos you know i try to take time and you know thank you guys individually but sometimes it be a little bit overwhelming but thank you so much for watching thank you so much for clicking and supporting me you know what i'm saying if anything i come on here because it makes me feel better when i talk to you guys i express myself I I cry, I laugh, and it just feels good because I feel like I have so many millions of new friends. That was just my boss right there, so I ducked real loud, um, quick, fast. So I love you guys so much. I'll be back, and wish me luck. Have a great day. Stay blessed and prosperous. I'm an irresistible magnet for all that belongs to me by divine right. His will be done, guys. I love you so much. And if nobody told you today, you are awesomely handsome and beautiful, and you rock. Peace. Okay, guys, I'm inside now. <laughs> I had to go and pick up the paperwork every morning. I have to go through the cash register and pick up the, the paperwork from the day before. And um, I put my coat in. Buzz the door. And we're in. I don't know who's up here yet. I was buzzing the damn door. Oh, 
Who is here? How is this going off? Oh, good morning. This is what it looks like first thing in the morning with nobody here. This is my area. Again, if you're new to my channel, that's my little work area. And this is my snack drawer. Yep. Gotta get some snacks. I told you, I'm trying to gain some weight. And, um, emergency coffee. If you know me, you know I'm a fiend for coffee. A fiend. And you see this hoodie right now? It ain't even heavy enough. I need something heavier. Y'all wanna watch me make coffee for the day? Okay, spend some more time with me. <clears throat> Ooh, that coffee is She's here creeping around. I'm out of here. Have a great day, everybody. Stay blessed and prosperous as always. Wish me luck. It's going to be a good day no matter what. Um, just pray for us. I know God is good and he see me. That's all that matters. I love you guys so much. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Don't forget to hit the bell. Um, don't forget to follow on Instagram. Everything will be in the description box below. And as always, stay blessed and prosperous. Peace.